before extreme sports, before the X Games, before it all, there was Dogtown and Z Boys. This was not the beach that people came to vacation at. This was the last great seaside slum. It was uh, paradise. You didn't go near that place if you didn't live there or know the people because you were going to get hurt. Surfing was it, and skateboarding was just an extension of our surfing. Grab your board and go sidewalk surfing with me. People thought this was some like stupid thing that little kids did. Zephyr team was the most influential skateboard team ever. No one was aggressive or as radical as they ever were. We were being paid to ride skateboards. It was crazy. The Zephyr team really sparked a revolution. Once pool riding came in, that's like all that we wanted to do. What Tony did one day, he goes up, pulls the board up, turns in midair, comes back down into the pool, and makes it. It just changed the whole ball game. Dog tunners get to go to Hollywood parties, and they get to hang out with rock stars, and they break into people's backyards and skate empty swimming pools. I'm in. Wow. By doing something that everyone said was a waste of time, we ended up influencing kids all around the world. There wouldn't be any X Games if it wasn't for most of the boys that I skated with and competed against. It was unreal. Dogtown and Z-Boys.